Purdue University is making changes to employee benefits to help deal with a budget deficit. In a press release, Purdue Treasurer Al Diaz said today that two changes in benefits are absolutely required, reducing the university's contribution to retirement and uh, toward employee health care as well. There was standing room only inside Purdue University's Fowler Hall. University Treasurer Al Diaz made his announcements on solutions to fix the projected $67 million shortfall by 2013. One message from Diaz is heard loud and clear. There will be changes to total compensation. We've identified uh, three different categories of uh, uh, activities that uh, we think uh, uh, are worth continuing to pursue. One is uh, a rebalancing of our compensation package, looking at uh, uh, total compensation uh, and potentially rebalancing salary and uh, benefits. Purdue Professor of Health and Kinesiology, Howie Zaloznik, is one of the professors who asked questions about the proposed change to benefits. He says these initial budget solutions are part of what he calls a new era for higher education in Indiana. We are moving into an era where we will have less general funds and we have to have some way of dealing with that. We can't make believe that the state's going to support us the way they have in the past. Diaz is focusing on employee benefits will help the university save $27 million a year. An additional $15 million can be saved by making organizational and process changes. A, a variety of activities, including strategic sourcing, uh, which takes advantage of the size of uh, the institution as a buyer. Another $25 million in savings still needs to be found to reach the $67 million goal. Diaz says this is all a part of keeping the university in a competitive position. The other part of uh, being competitive is uh, uh, to assure that we can keep the, the people, uh, retain the people that we need. That was Ava Wilhite reporting. Even with cuts to benefits and employee health care, the university will still need to find more savings to balance its budget. Purdue has put together a task force to help identify ways to save revenue. The university plans to have its first proposals on budget solutions to the Board of Trustees at their meeting in April.